Hello, this is Ask Michael Show, where you ask your productivity questions and I answer them. Let's go. Today, another question about apps we use and, and why we use them, and this, th this time about GitHub and Confluence. So um, GitHub, we use GitHub for code. Uh, we put code on GitHub. Uh, uh, we have private repositories where we, you know, publish a code. And we can't imagine anything else because it's really, really good for collaborative uh, working on code. And we are a software company. We want to share code. We want to use, you know, manage pull requests, manage changes uh, with many developers and many people who are watching the code. We need something that, you know, that's pretty useful. And GitHub also gives us this adv advantage that, you know, even non-developers can log in from our company and check the code or, you know, respond to comments or, or questions over there um, on GitHub. And uh, for w the other thing that we also need is, is a way to document things and to put, you know, like an internal wiki. And we used to use GitHub for that. Now we switch to Confluence, which honestly I don't like so much because it has really bad iOS apps. And again, for me, I am the iPad only guy. I use iPad for most of my work. And when the iOS app don't deliver, uh, I, I don't like the apps. So now we use Confluence, but we're right now testing Dropbox Paper and I think another one, Notion something. So we're testing a few tools right now because we want to make sure that we switch to a right tool to, come to, 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 um, to write documentation because we need documentation for the company, internal documentation. Because once you grow a company to a certain size, uh, things uh, need to be documented because otherwise people forget things and you cannot rely on just one person knowing something. And when this person is out on vacation, like, you know, things cannot get done. So we need that and we use, uh, yeah. So we're testing right now the, the, these, these apps uh, for that. And if you have recommendations of other apps that you use for documentation, you know, post them in the comments below. I will be happy to, uh, to respond and check them out. Thanks.